Hey, what's up guys? This is Anthony from Anthony's Customs and for this review we are looking at the Bandai of America Legacy Pink Ranger. This is of course the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers version. It's the only version of Power Rangers that I'll collect. I don't care about any of the other ones. So if you're looking forward to those, I apologize, but uh, I'm just going to stick with the nostalgia and go with the ones I grew up with. Anyway, this is the first of the female figures that I'll be reviewing. We already looked at the Black Ranger and the Green Ranger and they're basically the same figure with some slight differences and this one's all the way different so it should be interesting to look at it's a pretty cool figure overall but there are some things we need to talk about so let's go ahead and get it off the stand and take a closer look this figure stands just about 17 centimeters which makes it just about six and three quarter inches i know that's the same thing i said for the black ranger she's actually a little bit shorter he's a little bit taller uh, I'm just giving you rough estimates because it will depend on how you have them posed, leaning or not. So it's just to give you a, a, a general idea of the size. She's a little bit shorter, and I'll have a photo at the end so you can see that also. And like I said, all new sculpt for this one. Not the same as the other guys at all. Some slight differences in articulation, but generally the same overall quality. I want to point out the paint job on this figure is really good. You can see that the line work is nice and clean. There's really no bleeding anywhere. Even where they painted the stripe down here, it's very clean. The belt looks good. You can make out the uh, coin in there. Very nicely done. The face mask and visor, all very well done. There's really no issues with this figure in terms of the paint quality. I'm very pleased with it. They did the molding in white again for the boots and the gloves, so there's no real issues with the painting of the white. It's only on the chest and little details here and there, and they did a good job. Very happy with that. Again, the only accessory for her is the holster and the blaster, the blade blaster. And so that's not anything impressive, but it is included, so I guess that's okay. It would have been nice to have their iconic weapons, but I guess not for this price point. Maybe some other time. I guess there's an exclusive version of Jason, I guess, Red Ranger. He comes with his sword, but I don't know much about that. Anyway, as far as articulation goes, she's almost the same, but a little bit different. The head's still on the same hinge and swivel, so you can move that around very nicely. Also want to point out, I didn't mention this in the other reviews, they have separate necks. So that's molded in white also, and it makes it very clean looking. So that's it's pretty awesome. Shoulders, her shoulder actually works a lot better. It doesn't have quite that uh, weird shoulder pad thing going on. So that's nice, full rotation. And you can still bring it across the chest just a little bit, so that's pretty good. We do have our bicep swivel down here. Uh, this cut right here, it is a separate piece, but this isn't really meant to swivel. It'll pop apart if you pull on it. Um, that's just how it was assembled. Leave that alone. You just want to swivel it right here and you'll be fine. Single jointed elbow, but you still get 90 degrees, so that's okay. If you want it, you have the glove swivel, but I don't think you'll really use it because you have this fantastic ball hinge, which I absolutely love. I'm so glad they put that on there. For the torso, we don't have an ab crunch. We have a diaphragm joint. Sculpt work is a little iffy. I'm not sure why they made that pronounced swoopy, curvy cut there, but it's not terrible. It's okay. I just wish it was kind of smoothed out like the rib cage a little bit more. Uh, but it's okay. You still get good range. She can lean pretty far forward. Leans down to the side really well. I almost wish the other guys had this kind of joint. It, see, here's the thing. It's technically cheaper to make it too. So if you can make a good diaphragm joint, it's a, it's a better thing. It looks better and it functions better. But uh, most companies don't go that route. She does lean back and it does create kind of a gap issue. But it's not terrible. It's okay. She also has a waist twist, so if you uh, want that, you have that, so that's very nice. Now here's one downside the skirt. It is split so that you can use the hips, but the material is very stiff still. Can't really do much with the hips. So she has the same type of hips as the other guys, generally speaking. Hers are actually even a little bit closer to the Marvel Legends, uh, but the skirt holds them pretty much from doing anything. You do have a thigh swivel in there, so be aware of that. Double jointed knees work nicely. No problems there, as usual. We have a boot swivel if you want it. And then we have a nice ankle hinge. Brings the foot pretty far forward, pretty far back. And then you have the ankle rocker. So all in all, it's not a perfect figure. There are a couple issues here and there. But if you're a Power Rangers fan, these figures are definitely worth picking up. They're going to make you feel like you're getting your money's worth. Despite the lack of accessories, the articulation and paint... Very nice. So I definitely recommend it. I was not going to collect this line at all, but I'm very impressed by it, and I think you guys will be too. So there it is, guys. I, I think you should get them. Thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. I have new videos up every single day. We talk about action figures, movies, TV shows, video games, all kinds of fun stuff. We stream three nights a week. Uh, there's almost always something for you to watch on this channel, and you should find something you like too. So make sure you turn on notifications so you know about all that stuff. And in the meantime, uh, keep collecting.